This is histogram. We can divide the histogram into three parts, shadows, midtones, and highlights. If most of your histogram is on the left, it means the photo is underexposed. If it's in the middle, the photo is correctly exposed. If it's on the right, the photo is overexposed. Which one of these is correct? All of them. Let me explain, but first. Hi, I'm Martin, I'm a photographer at Photo Studio in Switzerland. For all the links, check out in the description. In this video, I will tell you three ways how to manipulate your histogram and why you should try to keep all the pixels within the histogram. Let's get into it. If we lower our shutter speed, photo is coming brighter and brighter. 1 25th of a second and even faster, 1 tenth of a second and our histogram is on the right. It means our photo is overexposed, even blown out as you can see on the photo. Second way how we can manipulate is our aperture. We can all close our aperture and the histogram is going to the left, it means photo is underexposed, or we can open our aperture, and now histogram is going to the right, it means photo is overexposed, and we are losing some pixels. Third way how we can manipulate with our histogram is ISO. At this moment, we are on 5000, we can make our ISO higher, 25,000, our histogram is to the right, it means we are overexposed or we can lower higher ISO, we are lowering ISO and the photo is coming darker and darker, it means our histogram will be on the left side. For our experiment we will take three photos right now. First one will be when the histogram is to the left. It's one photo. Second one when histogram is in the middle. And third one when our histogram is to the right. Okay, and now let's go to the computer and check it out. We are now in Lightroom and we have our three photos. First photo is almost black, as you can see on the histogram, all the pixels are on the left side. It means photo is underexposed. Photo number two looks quite good. Almost all of the pixels are in the middle, it means photo is well exposed. And last photo, most of them are on the right side, photo is overexposed, almost blown out. And now, first reset all three photos. So we'll start from the very beginning. First photo, underexposed, so we will increase the exposure of this one to, let's say, 2.7, second photo, it's okay, and third photo, we have to decrease the exposure, minus 1.7, and now we have three photos. First one, take a look on the histogram, photo number two, histogram look very similar, and photo number three as well, histogram look similar. The conclusion is when taking a photo try to keep all the pixels in the middle of the histogram so you can retouch the photo later as you want to. So don't be afraid of the histogram, try to keep all the pixels in the middle and shoot in the raw format so you'll never ruin a session. Like, follow, subscribe. Peace!